Let's take a lot of guts. Slip it in the back while no one's looking. You think I'm frightened about what people think? Well, you should be. Ah, oh, well, there you go. See, now I'm scared. Just don't get comfy. You think a little black eye is going to change anything, Kane? You're wrong. It doesn't. You still all talk. Is that right? It must kill you inside to think that you know what's best for Debbie, yet instead she picks me. You ever thought that that might be because I'm what's best for her? You? Yeah. So, listen, I'll tell you what. How about we agree to disagree, and then we'll save each other a whole load of trips to A&E? Deal? Yeah. Yeah, I think you're right. I think that would make things easier. I don't do easy. Maybe this is for your own good. So you knew? That's why you went round there. You were no, planning I it. You, I have no idea about anything. anything. I don't know. Listen to me. I don't He's going to do it. I don't know. know. I can't live without him. Well, you must have some idea. Did he say anything? I don't know. I think. Maybe. Where? Where? The quarry. No, Debs, wait. Let me come with you, babe. Just open the door, babe. Let me get in and I'll come with you. Why the quarry? Because that is where we were going to take him last time. To do what? Well, put it this way, it involves a car and a cliff. Missing a great view over here. Not another living person as far as the eye can see. Fine. Listen, Kane, you know what? You made your point now. Let me out of here, yeah? Then how are you going to enjoy the ride? Right. Hope you've got a good head for eyes. Right, Kane. I know you hate me for what I've done, but seriously, you think you're going to get away with this? <laughs> well, the way I see it, I've tried everything else. I've pleaded with her, I've turned my back on her, I've even cleared up after a little crime spree. We can sort this out, OK? Mm, that's why we're going to have to agree to disagree. Really? You're going to kill me for loving her? <laughs> you call what you did to her loving. Right, OK, fine. Listen, you let me go, I swear I will never hurt Debbie or Sarah again. You're never going to get the chance to let them down again. You do this, won't forgive you, OK? Won't, won't just be me you're killing. Yeah. Today it will be. Cain! You touch one hair on his head and I am telling you I'm going to the police and you will never, never see me and the kids again, right? What is it you want me to do? Huh? You want me to say I'm going to leave her and then you're going to let me go, yeah? Well, well, I can't. So you're going to have to kill me if you have to, but, but I'm not going to betray her. I'm betray her? I've already done that one. Okay, please, listen, I know, I know I've messed up, but... Never, not for one second, have I ever stopped loving Debbie. Please, just tell her that. I'm not going to tell her anything, because as far as she's concerned, you will have done a runner, just like you did last time. You don't want to do this. This will haunt you for the rest of your life. Yeah, I will live with that. But, Kane, please, please, listen. Listen. Right. You think wiping a few fingerprints is going to... is going to make a difference? They're going to know it's you, and then where will Debbie be, OK? Don't, that means Sarah and her will be without the both of us. Please, I'm, be I'm, I'm begging you. I'm begging you, give me one last chance and I swear I will not let her down. I mean, I came back to her, right? That must mean something. Well, you think she should be grateful? Well, no. Yeah, well, maybe she will lose me, but you know what? It'll be worth it. Kane, no! <sighs> Kane! Kane! Yeah. Kane! No! Please, no! Give me, give me a Give me no choice! God! What do you think you're doing? You're kill him, do it! You have to go over me first! Debbie, for God's sakes. So what's it gonna be? 
going to kill me as well now, yeah? Look, the whole thing could go any second. Debbie, don't be stupid. Listen to him. He's talking, Seth. Let him out! Oh, for God's sake, Kane, this has gone far enough. Shut up! You were ready to blow Chaz's brains out because of what he'd done to yeah, you. Yeah, because I loved him! And now I've got a chance to be happy again and you're going to take it away from me! Kane, you're going to get her killed! Can you don't see why I'm doing this for you. Because I love you! Then let me lead my life! Kane! You're going to choose him over your family. Don't make me have to. Oh, very touching. If you can just walk away from it. Cameron, no! But you could have Cameron, killed her! Get off him! You've gone far too Cameron! far! You've gone go far enough! I just want this to end! Looks like I'm not the only one with hollow threats. You come near me again. I'll say the big words. <laughs> You know what? I wish you both the best of luck. Something tells me you're gonna need it.